Hey, it's the NFL guy. Round two and three NFL. Draft. What's up, everybody? So uh, I was at work yesterday, and I was following it on my phone. Every pick, refresh, refresh, refresh on the ESPN app. Um, I feel like a lot of teams got some really good players, uh, especially like the Buffalo Bills. They did not trade the pick in the second round. So they got a receiver from Florida State, Keon Coleman, which I think that's a great pick. They definitely need a, a wide receiver. Also, the Chargers picked next at 34. They got Lad McConkey from uh, Georgia. So I got my tablet here so I can scroll through. I can't remember everything up here. Uh, but yeah, they definitely need to fill up the wide receiver um, roster for the Chargers. Let's go through some of these other picks. Uh, let's see, Tennessee got a defensive tackle to Rondre uh, Sweat, another Sweat guy in the NFL. Let's see, we've got, this is the one that I think, uh, I, I'm not 100% sure, but I think Green Bay traded with the Eagles. Maybe they traded with the Saints. I can't remember if they traded with 40-41. Cooper DeJean, the cornerback for Iowa. Wow, I'm telling you what. I think the Eagles is having a really good draft. So I like what they've done. Um, I think this is a uh, really great pick for the Eagles. And then New Age, New, New, oh, I almost said the New Age. New Orleans Saints got Kool-Aid McKinstry, the cornerback from Alabama. I bet you 100 bucks. there's going to be, like, so many fans going to be dressing up as the Kool-Aid man at Saints games. Um, I think that was a great pick. And let's see. The Raiders got Jackson Powers Johnson from Oregon, offensive guard. Uh, Edrin Cooper, linebacker from Texas A&M. Uh, the first running back. It was taking off the board. Carolina Panthers got Jonathan Brooks uh, from Texas. So I think that's a solid pick. They definitely need a wide receiver. Let's go through some of the... I think Cincinnati Bengals getting Chris Jenkins was a great pick. Let's bolster that defense. Oh my gosh, so many, um, so many players... There would be so many today. I'll actually get to watch most of the draft today if all of it, if the picks go really quick. Um, I don't go in until 4.30, so I'm definitely going to be able to see a lot of it. Uh, go Irish, Notre Dame player, uh, other than Joe Alt went yesterday. I think this is a great pick. Uh, Blake Fisher, uh, offensive tackle, went to the Houston Texans. I think that was a great pick. Uh, go Irish. We've got, oh, shoot. Hang on. Let me stop it for real quick. Oh, we're going into round three. All right. Let's go to round three. Uh, San Francisco picked up cornerback, Renardo Green. Uh, the Bears didn't pick until 75. Um, go, go figure. Chargers got a linebacker from Michigan, Junior Colson. So... Uh, he's gonna be playing with uh with uh Jim Harbaugh. He's his coach. Um, Dallas picked up an offensive guard, Cooper Beebe from Kansas State. Uh, Atlanta did not select a quarterback in the third round. They got an edge. Uh, Brandon Brandon Trice. We end up getting a offensive tackle. My Bears end up getting an offense tackle. Kyron. Amanda G. I can't even pronounce that. Um, about that, um, it just says real quick about it. It just says about might have been a top fifty selection had he not been limited to four games last season and restricted to what he could do workout wise leading up to the draft. With his mass and length, uh, Kyron passes. Uh, the eye test instantly, and he often dominated the Ivy League competition, but he has development player written all over him. Oh, boy. That's not good. Um, we got a defensive back, Callan Bullock. Went to the Houston Texans. Uh, let's see. What else do we got here? 
we got Michigan's running back went to the Rams. So we got Kyron Williams, my former Notre Damer, and uh, Blake Corum. Another Michigan guy, back-to-back. Back. Three Michigan guys went back-to-back-to-back. To back to back. Uh, went to the Rams. Pittsburgh got uh, Roman Wilson. And then the Browns ended up getting uh, Zach, Z Zach Zinter, a offensive guard. Uh, Max Sean Lloyd. Went the running back went to Green Bay. A lot of these late picks I didn't get to really get to see because I was um, at work and I was just like really super busy. Uh, what did you guys think of round two and three? Were you happy with some of the picks that um, your teams got? And then the last pick was Luke McCaffrey, the wide receiver from uh, Washington. So it's gonna be interesting to see. Um, who all goes? Obviously, I'm a Bears fan, Notre Dame fan, so I'm hoping Sam Hartman gets drafted today and Audric estimate that'd be great. So here we go. Draft is going to be about 23 minutes away. Um, I can't wait. Should be exciting. Rounds four, five, six, and seven. That's where you find the hidden gems.